I'm about to like use these four okay use these four little ipsy products basically it's like I just have a primer we're going to do some kind of highlight which I can always use my highlighter as like a eyeshadow I'm going to try out my mascara and I'm going to try out my lip gloss so the first thing we're going to do is use this Camelina and Strobe Primer. Yeah, it doesn't have a smell. Okay, so it came out like in this little... Wait. Can you hear this? I don't know. But it smells like there's like... When I squeeze it, it smells like there's something hard, like jellyfied in it. I don't know if that's like a good thing, but I'm just going to put this all over my face. I feel so weird like doing my makeup just to take off my makeup, but... Okay, so it just feels like a regular... This is like a regular primer that's like going on my face. Nothing. Nothing too crazy, I would say. Okay. So since I don't have eyeshadow, we're just gonna use this face case, uh, cosmetic highlighter. Okay, and I'm just going to use my fingers for this one just because I don't have a brush for it. I mean, I do have brushes, but I didn't, I was like getting up to get a brush, so, okay. This looks so pretty. It looks so pretty on my eyes. Oh my gosh. I mean, it kind of like blends in with my like natural skin. So. Mascara. There's really nothing special about it. It's just like a regular, schmegular mascara. Which I have like tons of mascaras. But. Yeah, I didn't do anything too dramatic to my lashes. I mean, I do have like tons of mascara, so like I have something similar to this. If I'm like looking up, it's because I'm looking into my big mirror that's like right there. I think that looks pretty... I, I'm not used to... I look weird. I feel like it looks so weird because I'm not used to wearing no... My face feels kind of soft. Okay, so this definitely made my skin feel somewhat softer this is just a highlighter just gonna put a little bit right here you know I actually like this I would actually just go out and like primer I would actually wear this on a daily basis. And now for my lip gloss. My lips definitely need something. Cause they're like chapped. Okay. 
obsessed. This is so, so I think this is going to be my new favorite lip gloss. It like feels so comfortable on your lips. It doesn't feel, it doesn't feel dry. It doesn't feel any of that. I like it. So, I guess I'm going to rate these one out of four. I do have um, a CC cream that I didn't put on, which is because I already got that in like a previous glam bag. So I figure I don't need to like test that out like I've done plenty of makeup to videos with that. But I actually definitely love this primer. Like the primer, the gloss, the highlighter, and then the mascara. That will definitely be so the mascara is gonna be like number four. The highlighter is gonna be number three. Lip gloss, number two, and number one, this is the, the primer. I love it. I love how it feels so soft. It says you're supposed to dispense a small amount on your finger, dab all over the face and neck, and gently blend towards your hairline. Wear under foundation or on its own for a susceptible glow. For more intensity, add it on top of your foundation. That is so cool. Okay. Okay. I do feel like my face is like glowing just a smudge. I love how my skin feels so soft. Okay. Okay, so. I would 10 out of 10 recommend you go out and get this primer if you ever see it in the store or if you ever get the chance to get it in like a glam bag or whatever I would 10 out of 10 recommend you try it the lip gloss this is in the color I really don't know okay I don't think it says yeah okay so this if you ever get the chance to get it in like a glam bag or like something, I mean try it. I'm sure there's like tons of other lip glosses that are like do the same thing. But my lips are so soft and like they were like dry because I was like just biting them and then I put this on and my lips feel, they feel so soft. It doesn't feel dry anymore or any of that. So. I don't know if they sell this in stores, this is like a collection, but if you do see it, try it. The highlighter, like, I didn't like it. I mean, there's tons of other highlighters you can get that are just like this. I mean, if I see it, I probably won't buy it again just because I did get it for like, in the bag. But I mean, like, you can find tons of highlighters for, like, you know, just tons of other ones. So, I do like it, but I would not recommend you spend your money on it when you can just go to, like, the Dollar Tree. I'm sure Dollar Tree has something similar to this. I'm not 100% for sure. And a mascara. You can definitely find some mascaras from Wet n Wild or Maybelline that are just like this it's like a basic mascara but I'm going to go ahead and go so I can get this up um, and then I'm going to go figure out who's going to be the subscriber of the day so I will see you in the next one okay so working motherhood you're getting the um, shout out for today I thought I'd been subscribed to her channel, but I guess I wasn't somehow. So I just like hit subscribe just now. But looks like she does like a lot of cleaning and organized videos and stuff. So I already know I'm definitely going to like her channel because like I always tend to watch decorating and cleaning videos. So you guys should definitely go check her out. Her link will be in the description below. And if you guys want to be on the big screen, 
in the next video, just leave me a comment down below and then I will pick a random person. Alright, I will see you in the next one.